Hello South Africa. Today is Thursday, May 26, 2022 and here are the top 5 stories that have made headlines for today. It took just 48 hours for Johan Rupert to become SAW's richest man again. After years of Johan Rupert rule, the distinction of being South Africa's richest man briefly changed hands this week, when the Bloomberg Billionaire Index suggested that Nicky Oppenheimer was $20 million better off than his wealthy counterpart. However, this adjustment didn't last for too long. Despite enduring months of sustained losses to his personal fortune, Johan Rupert saw his net worth skyrocket by $80 million yesterday. Nicky Oppenheimer couldn't exactly call it a bad day at the office either. Lotto, winner of 20.5 million rand jackpot could lose it all, check your tickets. Last chance, Ithuba is making its last call for the winner of last year's 20,569,105.0 rand to come forward. The lotto operator says it had previously encouraged the lucky ticket holder to come forward and claim their winnings, but to no avail. Now in a matter of days, the person stands to lose all of it as the ticket is now near expiration, this Sunday, May 29, 2022, exactly a year after it was won by the player in Carltonville. We urge players to check their tickets and to approach the Ithuba offices to claim prizes that are over 50,000 rand as soon as they realize they have won, said Ithuba CEO Shamain Mabuza. Well-known KZN resident killed after jumping from moving taxi. According to Reaction Unit SA, Rusa, spokesperson Prem Balram, the incident happened around 6.07. The 40-year-old Sholen Pandey, popularly known as PJ, was killed after he jumped from an out-of-control taxi that experienced brake failure on Softwood Crescent in Trainance Park, KZN this morning. Balram said residents contacted Reaction Unit South Africa, Rusa, at approximately 6.07 after the Toyota Hires taxi crashed into a metal barrier. Three men brutally murdered as mob sets their house alight. Three men were brutally murdered in Moroquing village outside Vryberg after the house they were in was set alight on Tuesday afternoon. Police in Porchefstrom remain on high alert following the incident in which some members of the community allegedly set alight a house with three men inside. According to the police, some members of the community went to a rented house at GA Mokofa section where three men from Carltonville stayed. Taxi T-Bones REA via bus in Joburg after skipping Red Robot. A minibus taxi and Ray via bus were involved in a nasty collision in Johannesburg on Tuesday, May 24. Traffic camera footage of the crash shows that the smaller vehicle ran through a Red Robot. The bus was traveling along Miriam Makiba Street while the taxi was heading towards it on Marshall Street. In a video clip of the crash, the minibus taxi driver can be seen skipping the red traffic light just as the bus passes through the intersection of the two streets. Please subscribe for more news updates. This is Leah for the South African.